this Lotte Championship. We did play some golf earlier, and Michelle Wee, who made the cut on the number, began on the 10th hole, and this was a putt for birdie. And she's really feeling confident with that stroke. She looks good with it, too. And as long as she keeps that same rhythm, it'll be good. And Michelle Wee with another putt for birdie. Using her shoulders, keeping her hands out of it. The lead 10 under belongs to Suyan Jang. Cut came at minus 178. Players made the cut. Brooke Henderson had a nice finish to her second round late yesterday. This is her tee shot at the fourth this morning. And I think that weather delay yesterday really helped Brooke Henderson to come back out. Different wind direction, very soft conditions, and she was able to capitalize. At the par five first, Canadian Elena Sharp to get to nine under and within one of the leader, Jang. And at the fourth, So Yan Yu. It was at this point that the rain began to fall, and a birdie would fall for So Yan Yu, and she would get to nine under par. But then that was not the the call to Luau. That was the stoppage of play, and the players headed for the evacuation vehicles. And it wasn't just about the rain. There was a nice big clap of thunder going on out there. So pretty dangerous for the players to be out there right now. Area Jatanagarn in the final grouping with Soyeon Jang and IK Kim. So let's update the leaderboard here for you as the rain falls. Uh, it was about uh, 12 minutes ago that the horn sounded. Jang, the sponsors invite, leading Jutanagarn Yu, Sharp, Kim at minus nine. Stacey Lewis has made it through one hole, looking for her first win in her last 70 starts, 69 consecutive without a victory. You go back to 2014. In B Park, former world number one, already a winner this year. And Lydia Ko, who was right on that cut line until late yesterday. She's picked up four shots in her first nine holes, and she's making a run, trying to hang on to her number one ranking. 